Welcome back to my channel Swazi in Kenya Beyond for the channel and my name is Zanel. So guys today is an exciting day for me. I'm being taken to a place where you can get uh, goat meat, sheep meat and very affordable prices. It's called Kia Maiko. And we are currently in all sorts. We want to take um, buses or matatus to Kia Maiko. So guys you join us on the journey and then we'll just take you guys around the place and then try to vlog if they allow vlogging um, around that place. We'll try to show you the meat and then whatever kilograms you have bought today. So yeah, let's go to Kiamai. And hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe, like, share, and comment. By the way, guys, um, I couldn't show you this mbuzi. I think it's an offer. We found it for 732. This is very big. It's quite heavy. How many kilos? 1.44 kgs. That is huge for Miyasaba. We usually buy this for more than 800, one kilo. Here. Um, but we got it at Carrefour. 1.4 kg for. 7.32, that's a thing, eh? It's heavy, it's very tender, it's very soft. So guys, we are currently in Kamaiko. Kamaiko is um, outer ring road. I cannot even explain the direction, but that is where we are. And currently, we want to buy some goat meat. They sell goat meat and sheep meat here. And then they sell the insides and all things like that. So we want to see how much we can buy goat meat for. There's a lot of um, slaughterhouses here, just a lot of them. So we want to see where we can get um, the best goat meat and at what price so i'll just show you guys around and then you'll just be able to see what this place looks like you can also come here and buy some goat meat yeah guys fortunately i managed to get someone to show me around one of the slaughterhouses they sell very nice fresh meat look at how big this piece of meat is so they sell for kilo sometimes 350 depending on the type of meat and sometimes of, uh, depends on the quality of the meat so you can come to this place i'll show you the name of the place make sure when you're in Kamai, Kiamai when you're looking for goat meat or looking for sheep sheep meat you can come here there's also insights you want to buy all of that today and then make some mutuas so let me just get an interview with one of the owners of this place so this is the meat you guys um, if you come here you will choose the one that you like and then they'll tell you the price and then it depends on the quality yeah the quality the texture the tenderness of the meat huh the oh you need say you need that dose it so quality ni yenye kona mafuta mafuta ina mafuta alafu ni pesi very soft very soft unaona ngati ina soft oh because ni dogo ni ni siang ah sawa sawa so guys come to kiamai what's the name of your slaughterhouse ab ab slaughterhouse i'll show you guys just the aponje so that you don't get lost what's your name sorry i have a website oh i normally sell online shakal halal shakal halal oh that's it so you own the slaughterhouse yeah ah that is very nice Of money yeah. it doesn't make you some money uh, not really. mm. I'm just a bit of effort, but I have my days when you want to Ah, sawa sawa. 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 Sawa sawa.
So that's the meat that we bought. Here ni kilo ngapi tumechukua? Saba. Kilo saba. Na hii itaenda? Eh? Itaenda hiyo pia? Oh, so, so we have bought that seven kilograms. Hiyo ni ngapi hiyo? Hiyo ni 380 kilo. So ina ina ni Kilo sio? Angalia. 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 So na na size na kilo. kama ni kilo. <laughs> Guys, we've gotten some meat, quite a lot of it. Yeah? Are you impressed with this place? Yeah, the prices, the prices are very nice, the people are nice. I just got friends. Yeah, so we, at least we have somewhere we'll be going to every time we want to buy meat here. It's a nice place. And then one thing that I liked about this place, their slaughterhouses are very, very clean, isn't you? They are very clean. They are very clean. They are kept very clean like always. They are always washing, the meat is clean, there's no flies anywhere. You even think they are not selling meat. Don't say that. They are, they are flies. I didn't see a they lot are, of them inside. But, but you know when they smoke, that means they are used games. Eh? Oh, for the meat. Uh, but they wash it like all the time. But they are flies, but not a lot. Yeah. So I think we like the place. It's a very nice place. There's a lot of slaughterhouses, so it's for you to choose and be able to park game. That is one thing that you need to be able to do. So guys, we are now going back home. This is Karkia Michael. And we are signing out here. See you in the next one. Bye. Oh, subscribe, subscribe. And like this video. Share it for other people to come here and buy some meat at very affordable prices. Sour. There's a lot of meat. What? Goat meat? Come. Sheep. They, they bring it from market. It's yeah. 20. And it's very nice meat. It's very healthy. Big. Yeah, so see you in the next one. This is Kia Michael. This is what it looks like. I won't be able to share this place with you guys. Let me go now. Take me back to a place where I felt at home. Take me back to a day when we weren't alone. Take me back to an age when the world felt small. Way back before we blew it all. Take me back to a place where I felt at home. Take me back to a day when we weren't alone. Take me back to an age when the world felt small. Way back before we blew it all. Too many things going on. I can't Keep track of them all From people dropping a bomb To people putting up walls I feel like life is on hall Perception stuck in a vault I know that We got the meat We got a lot of it The inside and uh, just meat So now we are going home We're just waiting for a matan to here Yeah, still in all sorts Going back home now We got a lot of meat At very very affordable prices I would definitely advise you To go to that place If you want to buy meat In large large quantities it's very, very affordable. Make sure you subscribe, like, share, and comment on this video. See you. Bye. A few moments later. So, guys, we're back home now um, from Kiamaiko. I want to show you guys all the meat that we bought. So, we bought um, 8 kilograms of meat, just plain meat. And then we bought um, one, I don't know how I can, it's, it's not weighed. They don't weigh the, they don't weigh the insides of the goat. Um, but it's one stomach of the goat. It has the, the heart, the liver, the whatever, the whatever, the whatever. Some other different parts of um, 
the insides of the goat and then we had to buy two livers so you buy these livers and um, separately liver is, is sold separately and then the insides they sell to you um, with the whole stomach whatever comes um, inside the goat is within that um, stomach and then you have meat separately some some places they will sell you meat at 380 some 450 some 330 some 300 so it depends really and then one thing we realize you guys there's a lot of brokers in Kiamaiko. so if you're not careful or if you cannot bargain they can really make money out of you so um luckily for me i had my husband guys ah this man can bargain i swear I need it. <laughs> he can bargain until you are all satisfied with the price and um, i think it's because we are in business so much so really we need to you know fight for our profit also in whatever we are doing so yeah 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 so that is what we did today i'm gonna show you the meat that place is clean the meat is always clean so for me it's just to rewash it again just to you know before i pack it in the fridge otherwise it's clean the insides there's nothing like smelling or mafia or anything so it's just pure 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 nice and clean so i'm just gonna unpack it wash it a bit and then i get it ready for um the fridge so yes you guys you can pass by kiamaiko if you want to buy meat in bulk that's gold and cheap they have it if you want to buy liver liver is very good for folic acid um and other 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 benefits um to women um and then you have the insides we will be making mutura so I'll be showing you guys how to make the African or Kenyan sausage mutura because our sausage is, is our mutura is like buravos if you're in the south of Africa. That's I think that's the language you'll understand. Yeah, buravos, olivosi. So we'll try to make it and see how it goes and I'll show you um, how it's made. So definitely stay tuned for that video because it's going to be interesting. So let me just pack these things into the fridge, you guys. I'll just wash them again just for my own cleanliness. And then I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you like, share, comment, uh, what do you call it, subscribe. Do everything you guys that you can do to support me and my channel. Who am I find homework? No. Huh? No. Sawa sawa guys. Sawa sawa. Let me help this one with the homework. We'll meet in the next video. So guys, this is the meat. Um, this is eight kilograms. We bought this at 340 Kenya shillings per kilo. Um, eight kilograms, you can do the mathematics and see how much we paid for all this meat. This is a lot of meat. For a family of three, this is just too much, you guys. We'll see um, how long it lasts us so that we know how many eight kgs we'll be needing after how long. So this is our first trial. Um, with eight kilograms of boozy yeah and then we want to see how long it can last us and then now we have the insides i'm also going to show you the um, the liver yes so this is the stomach it has different parts of meat inside and try to remove it huh? Oh, so there's the intestines as you can see so they usually pack it for you inside here this is the whole stomach 
all the parts of the stomach, the intestines. It's gonna be a good time as we make mutura. So because my husband made a lot of friends, you guys, they gave him this. These are Mikuya Mbuzi. Four of them. So this is like a whole coat ring. So we are going to use this um, for soup. I don't know how he removed this, but it has to remove the hooves. And then we will boil them for bone soup, ama soup bone, whatever you call it. That is good for your bones and for calcium. Yes, and this, the testicles, eh? the gold testicles. They say this is good for men, eh? 